five, four, three, two, one. I'm leaving quite early tomorrow morning. Hey everyone, Audrey here and welcome back to a brand new speed build stop motion style in the channel. Hoping you all having an awesome day. And in today's video, we are building NASA spaceship or is I referring it to a SNASA spaceship, Sims NASA spaceship, so many times I said spaceship, but uh, yeah, this is the build, this is what I came up with, and this is, I think, and I, I was searching and uh, looking for other builds uh, referring this build or this type of build, and I couldn't find any, so basically this is the first time someone on uh, the Sims game creating something like this, and, and, and I actually used the Simpsy size, as you remember um, my term, taking something from real life and bringing it into the Sims 4 game. And uh, yeah, the inside of the spaceship will not be like realistic because uh, the spaceship is uh, vertical and I cannot really build something vertical and make it usable. So I had to create the inside just like a normal house. And of course, that's, that's mainly because uh, my sim is an astronaut right now and I was uh, looking for a house for him and I said why not to create a real life uh, spaceship. So I came up with this and uh, I know it was, uh, it's been a delayed video because, um, you know, the, the new pack um, with, with the new items in it, uh, uh, the Eco Lifestyle Living uh, was out the day I was planning to uh, to release this video and I just couldn't resist trying to um, refurnish some of the stuff in this design using the new pack. So that's the reason why I had to delay this build because I was uh, planning to use a lot of the new items from the new pack inside this build uh, and at the end I actually used some of them, not too much, but it definitely uh, kind of improved the overall design of this build. Now one thing that I really need your help is, uh, maybe you know how to and I just couldn't find the way. I was planning to build this type of lot on the lab location. For those who don't know where the lab location is, the lab located on the Strangerville uh, map and it's kind of limited lot regarding building. Um, and I was trying to build over there and renovate it and I even used the cheat code enable free build and I just couldn't um, I just didn't get any access for the building mod in that lot so if you know a legit way how can I remake or renovate this lot uh, do let me know in the comment section down below if there is some sort of a mod I'm not gonna be against that because I really want to renovate or recreate the lab but uh, I really prefer a legit way to to use to do that so if you know the way how to uh, do let me know in the comment section down below uh, and, and of course, do let me know your thoughts about this build. In a few moments, you're gonna see the spaceship itself. Now, on the inside of the spaceship, I actually went with some sort of a futuristic technology design uh, because I, I, the spaceship itself built uh, uh, vertically, but I cannot really build inside vertically because it's not gonna be usable. I can build vertically using the tool mod, but I want it to be usable and functioning so you can actually do something in that uh, design so this build is actually a small family house again I built it for my astronaut and he was uh, only in a relationship with a lady so he didn't need much space space you got it and um, yeah so so I, I actually made it for one two uh, three four family of five, uh, not five, four, uh, four people can live in this build. Of course, uh, parents and two kids, probably. And yeah, so I, I couldn't really create the inside just like a real spaceship, but I still uh, hope you're gonna enjoy it and, and gonna love it. 
And uh, of course this build is on the gallery to download and trade files for the crack version in the description down below. Make sure to copy paste the password for, uh, for the uh, file. And I do want to invite you, those who are playing on the original version of the game, to follow me on the gallery and it will make your life much more easier every time I'm publishing a new video. In a new build you will get a notification i think uh and you don't need to look for the build or or thinking how i uh how i named the new build you're just gonna get it directly into your game so i do uh do invite you all to follow me over there also right now you can see the spaceship being created and soon we will be inside of it and you'll see the futuristic kind of design that I created. I really hope you're gonna enjoy it. I really hope you're enjoying this video and and uh, and yeah. And of course, one small thing that I want to point out that I think we're about to be in the part four of our Let's Build an Arcade. And a lot of you are commenting and loving that uh, build in that series. And it's so heartwarming to read all of those comments and see how you all are um, so hyped for uh, each time I'm releasing a new episode. And one small thing that I really want to point out that some of you really want to fill the whole arcade with so many <laughs> things regarding arcade builds. But I want to remind you one small thing. It is the local arcade. This is the project name, okay? This is like the neighborhood arcade. We are not gonna have all the things that you can get in the arcade, but if the build is gonna be a success, maybe I will create an arcade center. Okay, and that thing is gonna be big, it's gonna be uh, much more uh, filled with uh, um, arcade related uh, machines and things, uh, things related to arcade build. And uh, yeah, so that will be coming. I I'm not sure if it's gonna be in the next week or next after that. We are, we're gonna need to finish it uh, sooner or later. But again, I'm creating so many things together that um, I, I just need to find the right amount of time investing on, on each one of the uh, parts. And of course I'm talking about building and editing and, and of course uh, playing sometimes, you know. And of course living, yeah, I'm doing that also when I'm creating stuff for, uh, for YouTube and, and for you to, uh, to enjoy. Uh, so I definitely need to find uh, how I juggle the whole thing together. But uh, yeah, we are getting closer to the end of this video and I hope you enjoyed it. So now it's my cue to ask you nicely that if you enjoyed this video, do not forget to drop a like and leave a comment with your thoughts about it. And if you are new here, consider subscribing to the channel for every week new video, new building, new design. And until the next time, keep that seems party going for me, RGR Gaming, signing off. I'm leaving quite early tomorrow morning.